Well, as you can see, I've got front shock absorber off and the anti roll bar link off. And there's the bolt. What I'm about to do is put a two inch lift kit on the front. And I believe this is the correct way to do it. So I'm going to go and open the kit up now that I got from a company in Canada, which is here. It's a Perflex 2 inch lift kit for my 570 Razor. Their part number 1531269. So we got. Instructions, bag of bolts, they're the rear brackets, rear left and right, so I'm not going to worry about them tonight because that's not what I'm doing, somewhere I hope, there they are, there's four of these. These are the front brackets, which I believe go there to relocate the shock absorber and the shocker then goes onto the top mount. So I'm going to put the camera on the tripod now and try and figure out how these two go onto there. Well, there's the new hardware. Bracket bolted through. Get me torch. And in there is a spacer. Bolted onto the other side. And then the shock's bolted between that. And in there's a washer either side of the shock to take up the extra clearance. And then using the original hardware the spacer, the anti-roll bar, the washer and the nut and it's all gone bolted back together and it's absolute dead easy to do so that's the front, the front's very very easy yes very very easy quite happy with that, I think I'll put the wheel back on and go and do the other side So well, there we are, final fitting of the kit. Two each left on the front. And all the hardware's there. Anti roll bar still on. And I have done the other side as well now. So as you can see. Well, I've got some ground clearance. Next task is to do the front, uh, do the rear, sorry. I'm being an idiot now, I've just done the front. Quite neat, simple, really easy to fit. Uh, really happy with the kit. Everything's fitted with absolutely no problems. Everything's lined up.